So this question starts off by giving us this expression, 8 minus i divided by 3 minus 2i, where i just means imaginary. So let's see what the question says to see how we need to use this expression in order to find the answer. So the question says, if the expression above is rewritten in the form a, a plus bi, where a and b are real numbers, what is the value of a? All right, so let's see. A plus B I. Now we started off with eight minus I over three minus two I, but somehow we want this whole thing here to be written as a A in the form of A plus B I. So not a fraction, right? So starting out as a fraction, but we want it, again, the question says rewritten in the form a plus bi. So what can I do with this fraction here to simplify it? So if you recall, we don't like to have imaginary numbers in the denominator. So what I'm going to do is multiply by the conjugate, which hopefully sounds familiar to you, and is really just the denominator with the sign flipped out in the middle. So instead of minus 2i, I have plus 2i. So for the top, I'm going to FOIL 8 minus i times 3 plus 2i. So first times first gives me 24. Outer times outer gives me 16i. Inner times inner gives me minus 3i. And last times last gives me minus 2i squared. And on the bottom, when I do the exact same thing, I end up with, again, first time first is 9, 3 times that is plus 6i, negative 2i times 3 is minus 6i, negative 2i times 2i is negative 4i squared. So to continue to simplify this, I'd have 24 plus 13i, right, because 16i minus 3i. And then 2i squared, i squared, and we kind of have that note here. If i is equal to square root negative 1, that means that i squared is equal to square root negative 1 squared. So i squared is equal to negative 1 because the square here crosses out the square root. So that means that I'd have 24 plus 13i and then minus 2 times negative 1 all over these two things cross out, positive 6i minus 6i. And again, I have another i squared here. So I'd have 9 minus 4 times negative 1. So continuing to simplify this way just for space, I'd have 24 plus 13i plus 2, which is the same as 26 plus 13i. And on the bottom, I'd have 9 plus 4 which is the same as 13. Then I can simplify this, right? So I can reduce this fraction because 13 goes into 26 and it goes into 13. So 13 goes into itself one time. 13 goes into 26 two times. 13 goes into this 13 one time. So what I'm left with is two plus basically one i. And that is in the format of a plus b i, in which case, a equals 2 and B equals 1. The question here is asking me what is the value of A. So, right, so we have A value, A's value is 2. So therefore the correct answer is choice A.